The family of a man named Christopher Olivares has waited nearly three years for justice, but that wait is almost over. Yeah, the man accused of killing him accepting a plea deal today, but as our Erica Hernandez reports, the sentencing is still to come. State of Texas versus Sebastian Hernandez. This packed courtroom was prepared for a trial. Instead, Sebastian Hernandez agreed to a plea deal in Christopher Olivares' murder. Mr. Hernandez, to the offense alleged in count one of this indictment as a first degree felony, the offense of murder, how do you plead? Guilty, not guilty, or no contest? Uh, no contest, no. The plea deal comes almost three years after Hernandez stabbed Olivares in September 2021. Police said the men were acquaintances, but it's not clear what led to the murder. Hernandez was arrested nine months later after his DNA matched forensic evidence at the crime scene and on the murder weapon. Sentencing will now take place on October 1st. What it will look like, a sentencing hearing will take place. Witnesses will be called up, and then the judge will decide what to sentence Sebastian Hernandez. The maximum she can give him per that plea deal is 32 years in prison. During the sentencing hearing, Judge Cristina Escalona will consider if this was a crime of sudden passion. That means the defense will try to prove Olivares provoked Hernandez before the murder. If Hernandez violates bond or commits another crime before sentencing, the plea will be off the table. Erica Hernandez, KSAT 12 News.